Ron Steffen is being honored tonight as the 2018 Campbell County Cooperator of the Year. Ron was nominated for the award by the Campbell County Conservation District for his hard work to improve the quality of his land in Campbell County. I was uh, actually born and raised right here in Cold Springs. My mom and dad built that house right there next to the church. And I graduated from St. Mary's in 59. My godfather was uh, really good to me and he got me a job uh, at Albers. Albers was in Newport Shopping Center there and he was the head meat cutter there and I got a job cutting meat. He was into cattle. I've always, heard some, you know, for some reason you like the stuff and you don't really know why, <clears throat> but I always did like fooling with the cattle. He sold me a, a couple cows. And in the meantime, after, before that, when I, after I was uh, married, we lived in, luckily lived in an apartment in Bellevue for three months and I had an opportunity to buy uh, 36 acres on Yule Road. And that's when I start getting some cattle. So I had cattle probably for from a, since the time I was in my very early 20s. That's pretty fortunate, you know. I had some really nice cattle along the way. <laughs> and I always kind of liked the farm aspect, and I always did want to get a pig farm. But then I was lucky enough to get in the elevator trade, and I really liked that too. I thought I died and went to heaven when I got cut meat wasn't doing that no more, and I, I did. I got in the elevator trade, and it, boy, it was kind of complicated, and I didn't know much, and I thought, boy, I'm gonna work harder than anybody else, but I don't ever get laid off. And then after a while, you get think, well, I can do this, and I can do that, you know? So you start learning the trade. I finally got about four or five cows, and I uh, artificial bred them, and they took Luckily, just every time I bred them uh, and the artificial, you get the cream of the crop. You go through a book and pick out the bulls. I had some fantastic calves, and I wish I'd have kept pursuing that, but I got into the elevator trade and the cattle kind of got to be second fiddle because I had a really good job, and that was most important to me for quite a long while. Ron is currently raising cattle on his farm and raises beagles for hunting. He says his main goal with farming is to produce quality cattle and be a good steward of the land. Since buying his property, he has made many improvements. The first task he had was removing all the brush that had grown up on the property. Ron heard about available cost share programs from fellow farmers and began implementing them on his farm in Bracken County. When he purchased his property in Campbell County, he continued to use cost share programs to improve his property. With technical expertise and cost share programs from the Campbell County Conservation District and Natural Resource Conservation Service, Ron has fenced his cattle out of sensitive areas, like streams and ponds, and has installed watering systems to provide clean drinking water to his cattle, while also giving him the ability to set up a rotational grazing system to better utilize his pastures. He has installed a heavy use area to reduce the amount of soil and nutrient runoff of his feeding area, while also improving the health of his cattle. Ron has also utilized CAIP funds to clear invasive bush honeysuckle to expand grazing area. Ron also credits Don Sorrell with Campbell County Cooperative Extension as a big help with the numerous programs he puts on. Ron remembers the first time he gave his cattle shots and Don was happy to come down to assist. Campbell County has really improved the cattle industry and a lot of that is thanks to Don Sorrell, says Ron. Any farmer is willing to help another farmer. Ron is also a member of the Cattle Association, where he served as president for two years. I just love being outside. When he isn't busy on the farm, Ron has many hobbies. He loves to fish and hunt, and said he's had beagles for rabbit hunting since he was 12 years old. I got three brothers, none of them hunt. So, you know, I love my brothers, and we, we play cards and that together, and I said, and they all golfed. So probably when I was about 45, I took up golf so I could do something with my brothers. And I'm glad I did, because we go on at least now one or two trips, a spring trip and a winter trip or fall trip and, and go somewhere golfing. And they're, they're all good guys, and I really enjoy that. Ask any one of my kids, and they love growing up on a farm. 
just a great life, really. Ron has some advice for anyone thinking about farming. If you have any desire at all, you need to get involved. If you want to get into cattle, then you need to get involved with the Cattle Association. You need to stay up to date on the numerous programs that are available, along with the funds available. Thinking, wow, I don't know if I deserve this. As there's a lot of, uh, a lot of good uh, farmers out there, you know, and uh, I've I've had a lot of help. I've really uh, did. I, I kept going up the chain and how I did things, you know, trying to be a good conservationist, you know, treat the land with respect. Ron looks forward to many more rewarding years on his farm and a continued effort to implement conservation practices and conserve natural resources for generations to come. Congratulations to Ron Steffen on being selected as the 2018 Campbell County Conservation District Cooperator of the Year.